By now, almost everyone knows that smoking has been linked with lung disease, cancer, and heart disease. But most people aren't aware that smokers are three to six times more likely to have periodontal disease and two times more likely to lose teeth. Periodontal disease is an infection of the teeth, gums, and the bone that surrounds the teeth. The main cause of periodontal disease is plaque. Plaque is the sticky film of food and bacteria that forms constantly on your teeth. These bacteria produce toxins, and these toxins, combined with your body's reaction to them, destroy bone around your teeth. Smoking helps cause periodontal disease in two ways. It reduces the production of saliva and damages the body's ability to fight off the infection. Saliva helps wash bacteria from the teeth, so less saliva means more plaque and tartar. Saliva also contains disease-fighting antibodies that help fight destructive bacteria in the mouth. Smoking damages your immune system by causing blood vessels to constrict throughout your entire body, which reduces the flow of infection-fighting white blood cells, oxygen, and nutrients to the gums. Besides contributing to the onset of periodontal disease, continuing to smoke after periodontal treatment makes it much, much harder for your gums to heal. So if you haven't yet thought about quitting smoking, consider this. By becoming a non-smoker, you can strengthen the fight against periodontal disease and keep your teeth.